Ice that took 2,000 years to form is melting away on Mount Everest. Now the world's most famous base camp is being moved further down the mountain so cracking ice doesn't claim more lives. CTV's Tom Walters on the end of an older, colder time. The South Base Camp on Mount Everest is just the starting place for climbers. But located on a thinning glacier, it's becoming increasingly dangerous all by itself. Before making his second trip to the summit of Everest earlier this spring, Arthur Prestige camped at the base near a rock retaining wall. That collapsed because of um, melting ice. Of course, he saw crevasses during the climb, but officials in Nepal now say they've been opening up under the tents at base camp. And while Prestige was there, he was able to wash clothes in an ever-growing stream of meltwater. That river was quite small initially when we got there. Um, when we left, it was um, pretty big, um, huge in fact. With some 1,500 people there during the peak of the season, human presence and human waste may have some local effect, but the melting is happening higher up the mountain too. Prestige saw it here on the first part of the ascent. There was a lot of ice melt there in the Kumbu ice falls. The cold fact is the whole Himalayan range is warming up. A team from Western Washington University studied conditions there in 2009 and again in 2019. The mountains are probably 20 degrees warmer. Um, everything um, is melting much qu more quickly. In fact, the annual rate of glacial melting has doubled in the past 20 years. And if the global temperature rises just 2 degrees over the next 80 years? Almost half of the uh, glaciers will be, will be melted away. That could threaten water supplies to some of the most heavily populated countries on Earth. Which means that for now, a plan to move the base camp on Mount Everest is a sharp reminder that the whole world is facing an uphill climb. Tom Walters, CTV News, Los Angeles.